The camp is set in Yelgan, um, in the Byron hinterlands. Uh, we're just north of Byron Bay uh, and about seven minutes drive from the ocean uh, on top of a hill looking down into Maynard Valley. The plans of the camp originally came from a triangle idea that I had one night. And the idea was that when you're camping, you need three things and to make it really comfortable and good and a really good experience that we, from our like research and travels, was that you need a fire pit, you need like amenities in a cabin, and then you need your tent. Uh, well, the camp is completely off grid. So we run off solar power and um, we have a composting toilet. We're not plugged in at all. And so we started with the cabin, which is what we built first, which is actually a tiny house. It's on um, a trailer and wheels, which can be moved around and kept mobile. Uh, and so, I mean, the, the idea was to build something sustainable and as eco-friendly as possible. So I built it myself out of timber, renewable resources, ply and things like that. And then we've just got like a deck that links our uh, canvas tent, which is a six metre canvas bell tent and then uh, over to the side is a fire pit. Yeah, so when you walk into the cabin, you walk into our kitchen and breakfast bar area um, and that's fitted out with a little uh, bar fridge and sink, uh, two burner stove, um, all the essentials for like a easy, like good little kitchen and then uh, behind you is a, a big open window and then you just walk through the cabin to the back is a fully functional bathroom. So hot showers, sink, uh, mirrors and, and a toilet. Then through to, through to the tent, um, obviously a queen size bed, um, a bed head that kind of divides a bit of a space and, and funny enough it actually means that it, you actually have a bigger space because you're creating uh, the, the, a divide in the room. And then on the other side of that bed head is like a lounging area some chairs, tables and things like that. Life unhurried to us, I guess it means trying to just do better where you can and not being afraid to like start something. So uh, small steps in the right direction, uh, composting and growing herbs and then getting a bigger compost the following year and then growing vegetables and then enjoying that experience uh, and then reaping the benefits from it and showing your friends and, and spending that time with friends and family, um, real experiences as opposed to digital experiences and just seeing yourself get happier as it develops.